Hi, I'm Dr. Richard Gold, and I'm so happy to have this opportunity to share my enthusiasm and appreciation for this device, the Dr. Ryder's Neck and Shoulder Relaxer. My interest in this product is both personal and professional. Firstly, professional. I use this a lot in my clinical practice. My clinical practice is in Chinese medicine and acupuncture. I've been practicing and treating patients for the last 38 years. I'm also an educator in the field of Chinese medicine, and I was one of the founders of the Pacific College of Oriental Medicine and served on the board of directors for many years. At this time, Pacific is the largest organization of Chinese medical education in America, and is an accredited, um, accredited institution teaching all the way up through the doctoral level of education. Many people come to see me for neck and shoulder pain and tension. It could be chronic, it can be acute, it could be the result of accidents, a variety of things. What we found is that a combination of treatment and home care is very essential for long-term benefit for neck pain. And the Real Ease really provides a tool that can, people can use both here at the clinic and also at home. It's very uh, easy to use, it's very uh, therapeutic, um, it's simple, it can be used in the bed, it can be used on the floor, it can be used on a massage or treatment table. There's something that can be used for self-care because what happens with a lot of chronic neck pain is people go through a, a cycle of pain. And when the pain gets acute, if they can learn to just really relax, oftentimes that pain sequence will go down and there won't be a need for any kind of medication or treatment or any more rad radical approaches to help. So the Real Ease is uh, very easy to use, as I mentioned. Um, what it does is it cradles the head, and the unique patented design of it allows for the weight of the head to traction the neck. And we find that this is very, very beneficial for the whole neck and shoulder area, but especially the upper two cervical vertebrae, where the, where the skull sits on the atlas, the C1, cervical 1, and then strengthened and stabilized by C2. Now, what I'd like to do is uh, demonstrate this with my, uh, my assistant and student, Kara, and uh, she'll be joining us in just one minute. I'm going to stop.